hundreds of cars surrounded the Tacoma Dome Wednesday. I go through the drive. Every week I'm I'm here. It's the weekly drive up food giveaway hosted by Eloise's Cooking Pot Food Bank, serving people like Cherie. Because you know if you go to the store, you're going to spend forty dollars every time you go into the store. So celery. Like I said, the nice foods that they do give you help you later on in the month. We generally serve about four hundred people on a normal Wednesday. We're expecting somewhere between five hundred and six hundred people today. Eloise's Cooking Pot owner Andrea Blue says this is their special Thanksgiving event where they give out food and grocery gift cards. The goal is to show love to others. When I started Eloise 15 years ago, I named it after my grandmother, African American grandmother. You can always get a hot meal at an African American grandmother's house no matter what, no questions asked. They have seen a spike in need since 2020 and now serve around 75,000 people each month through their food giveaways, home food deliveries and more. We started it for the community and the community still owns it. They tell us what they want and we have the privilege of going to get it. I'm from the area. And this is what we do. This is how we show up for our community. The drive up food giveaways used to be held in a neighborhood near Eloise's Cooking Pot's current location on McKinley Avenue, but they needed more space due to the big turnout. That's why the Tacoma Dome stepped in to help. We have this open lot um, that was available for Andrea to use and what a better way to partner with someone that is giving back to the community. This is a place where people come not just for food, but also for community. But never be embarrassed because we all we're all in this together. In Tacoma, Connor Board, King 5 News.